Cheers, friends, and welcome back to Fallout 4 Horror. I'm the Bonsai Butterfly, and we're here in Whispering Hills. We've got the keys, and the last thing we need to do is go back and talk to Lisa. So let's do that, shall we? Yeah, let's head back to her. Oh boy, um, this has been um, a real super nightmare, but um, yeah. We need to go downstairs. This is the way to go, I think. Yeah, we've got through everything that needs to be gotten through. Um, hopefully, we can go talk to Lisa. have all the keys I think we need. So let's head in and have a chat with her, shall we? There she is. Yeah. Right. Lisa! Did you find the key to the sewers? Yeah. Yes, I have it. Uh, uh, right here. <laughs> Wonderful. Still able to help you. Please take care. Sean and Claudia deserve better in life. Remember, they are in apartment 302. All right. Good luck. And please be careful out there. Yes, thank you so much. I will make sure they are safe. Will you be okay here? I'll come back for you, okay? I will be fine. I will be fine. I'm sure any minute now they will send the burn victim in here, so I have a busy night ahead of me. Please, just get them out of town before the fire gets any closer. Okay. Well, um... Do you know more about the order? Usually they just keep to themselves. Right. They do have a pretty old mindset. I think they read the Old Testament or something. They don't like other Christians or really anybody. Everyone says they are into some pretty spooky things. They leave these weird symbols all over town. I think I've seen those symbols. Yeah. Do you know more about Sean or Claudia? I don't know them very well. Sean and Claudia seem to be friends, but with the order interested in them, I wasn't really able to speak with them much. Although I'm pretty sure Claudia's father is abusing her. I knew I'd never be able to just tell the police. As many of them are members of the order, just like her father, who all go to the big church in town. I see. Hmm. Can you remember more about what happened to this town? Well, right now the fire is getting bad, but I don't know anything about it. I haven't heard any news about what is going on. I mean, about fog, the darkness, and the monsters. Do you have an idea where this is all happening? You mean the smoke? I... <sighs> what monsters? I don't really know what you mean. You... This town has always had a dark side. Sure, some people can be monsters, but every little town has problems, right? Yeah, nothing like these problems. Are you completely out of it, or what is your story? And you know nothing? Right. People are monsters. Why don't you come with me? I think I can protect you. I'm sorry. I'm still waiting for my patient to come in. 
There must be a lot of burn people out there and I will probably be pulled in to help doctors with the overflow. Please be safe out there. Okay, Lisa, so you're about to be swamped by people. You're the only nurse down here who's doing this work. You're the one who's going to be the deciding who lives and who dies down here, I think. Yeah. Is there anything I can help you with? Well, we have her key. We could go in here, which this door is barred. And I don't think, um, yeah, no matter what you do, you can't activate it. So this other door leads out here. Oh, okay. So we are out next. Oh boy. <laughs> All right. There's a key I need to get here. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, let me first do some aid before I step in. This looks like a boss battle arena, guys. Uh, that's 50 hit points. I'm going to eat that. Yum. Let's get up to max health. Oh, yeah. Also, I think... <laughs> do I have some buff out? I do have buff out, but I don't want buff out. I want buff tats. Yeah. I'm addicted to buff tats. Good. Good, good, good. <laughs> but let's see if I can get a sick to psycho buff too. No, I do have a Dictatol. I'm going to take that. Uh-huh. Right. Oh, bring okay. it! This looks like the exit. Can we get out? Requires a key. Oh boy. Leave me alone, yo! Get out of the way from 
from me! Get away from me, you big mouthy critters! I bulked up on drugs. I had it all together, man. All right. Uh, let's see. Stats. I don't think I've taken any drugs yet. Just before I did. Let me make sure. Buff tats. Medics. Psycho buff. Addictus all. Blood pack. All right. Yeah. That's right, Maggie. Come on, you. It's a this thing is a beast, man. There's the key. 
some extra Simpax and a 10 mil pistol. Yeah! <laughs> it's back on 10 mil pistol, right? Ah, wow. Okay, so. Hi, imagine that takes us out of the hospital, or at least somewhere close to out of the hospital. Uh, this is baby rattles and stuff. This takes us into the storeroom. Right, I think where I want to go is here. Now, the next thing says get to the hospital. So, we're going to head over that direction. Um, hmm. <laughs> that monster with your dread mouth. Oh my god, that thing was horrible. <laughs> Tough to beat, man. Um, even on all those meds and stuff, he still, like, cracked me good, man. I had to keep on saving. He kept breaking arms and legs and stuff. Well, we don't have any armor, so, you know. All right, so let's... Come on, Fumble Fingers. Let's get it right. Um, okay. So we need to get out of the hospital. By going downstairs, huh? All right. Is this the way? No, it's not. I keep hearing stuff walking around. Yeah, this is not the right way. Is this the right way? This may be the right way, yes, I think so, yep, that'll work, that gets us out, now let's run around the outside. the way to go sewer maintenance key yes okay this leads down to it well what's on the side here a key scrapyard key oh to sewers uh-oh thank you for playing whispering hills episode two we spent a lot of work on this release and hope to entertain you with episode three that leads you to the apartment complex if you like our work please become a patreon at this address Join our discard, etc. and so on. So, <laughs> hope to see you all in hell. So, yeah, do them a solid, guys. Uh, really great, great um, mod. I think it was a lot of fun. Now, what I need to do now is that's the uh, trash yard right over there. So, we need to go over there. Into the scrap yard. I think there's a key for it. I just got... Um, it's, I think it's the only way to get out of town. <laughs> is the scrapyard key. Now, what I got to do is find my way into the scrapyard. And I'm not sure, was there a way in from in here? Uh, there might have been that I missed. No. There isn't. At least I don't think there is. Wait a minute. Uh, no, not this way. Uh, around the corner, maybe? Yeah, that's where you're supposed to go when they finish the story, but they're, uh, they're not finished with the story yet, so... Where's the scrapyard? Here it is. Here we go. Right, come in here. I'm gonna head in this building. There it is. Blue barricade key. So, 
Now we know we can't we can't go <clears throat> We can no longer do any of this going underground because that's episode three and that is not yet released so <clears throat> I'm gonna place um, My quest marker in an area where we can get out of here head back to the Commonwealth And use the exit that we use to get in this place. So that's what we're going to try and do. This should open. Ah, uh, yeah, there's our boy. In the middle of the streets. La la la. He won't know we're here. Does this open? Of course it doesn't. Of course it doesn't. This one's the one I have to open up here, I think. <clears throat> I think so. Yeah. Okay, so our exit should be down this way. There it is. Let's get out. This will take us back into that hallway. Now, everything that we have on us that we got in Whispering Hills. As you approach further in the corridor, you feel that everything you have gets dragged toward Whispering Hills. Your stomach quivers. As you are just a few steps away to lose everything. Well, yeah, true. You feel a cold shiver as you pass through the corridor. It feels like you left a dream, or have you entered one? Your senses go numb, and your attachments have been sucked towards Whispering Hill. So all that stuff that we just got... As you approach further the corridor, you feel that everything you have gets dragged towards the Commonwealth. Your stomach quivers as you are just a few steps away to lose everything. Haha. <laughs> oh. I think she wants and she's had enough of this we're getting out of here so episode three is what we're waiting for but there's some loose ends to tie up first that's right we need to go have a chat with claudia's father back at vault 111 and this will take us out to dumbwich boars ah Okay, there we go. There's the box. Transfer everything. Yes, now let's get back to fighting trim. Let's get that army helmet on. Let's get the leaded shadowed. And that as well. Yep, get our armor back on. Get our night dress back on. We missed it so much. <laughs> there we go and I still have those welding goggles wrong way Ralph fumble fingers get it right uh, I don't want this revolver pipe pistol yeah I guess we do um I'm gonna favorite Kar Kremba's tooth instead of the combat knife let's see silent death that was up here as I recall Snubnose 44, the gainer, is here. And Zombie Slayer, all the way on the end there, because we still have zombies we need to slay. We're carrying 314 of 380, that's perfectly fine. But now, it's time. Oh boy, look at my hit points. They're almost down to zero. Let's do something about that. I have 34 stim packs. <clears throat> Let's take a couple. Yeah, let's do it. All right. Now, do I have any water? Psycho buff is what's on there. Uh, let's see. A paid, uh, purified water. Yeah, let's put that here. There we go. That's right. There we are. Okay. Now, in here, here we go. In a down, down, down. 
we need to go through this little hole here. Uh, and then through this hole here. And then up. <gasps> Leap out. Whew. All right, we're out. We're out, we're in. <laughs> we're out, we're in. We're in Dunwich Boars. That's fine. We've escaped Whispering Hills, but our son is still missing. We don't know how to find him. But that is a tale for another day. However, there are a few things that we can do. First of all, the one thing we want to do is get up on out of here. Now that's a way out, up that way. I think I want to go that way instead of running through. I think we killed everything up here, but I'm not sure. Boy, it's all still laying here just like we left yesterday. And, you know, we may have just left moments ago. Up, up, up the steps we go. Let's get out of here. I don't know if this leads out or if it leads back into another part of Dunwich Boars. I can't remember. But I can say, I want out. I want to go. We never did come up here and check this place. What's this? Yeah, maybe we did. Up, up. What's that stuff? Squirrel stew? Yeah, I want that. Ah, okay. Now, which one goes down? This one? Yup. That should bring us just about to the end here, I think. Yep. There we go. Whew. Okay. <laughs> we battled a great beast. We talked to poor Lisa, who seems a little bit messed up, but we couldn't get the final part of the story completed. I think we're outside, so I think we can fast travel. Yeah, we can fast travel from this location, I believe. Let's head back. Well, let's head to Vault 111. Let's have a chat with Claudia's father, shall we? Now, Lisa had said something about him beating her, being part of the cult as well. Was she mistaken? Did she think someone else was her father? Or is she saying that this gentleman up here is her father. Don't really know. So. Yeah, Siren Head's over there. I know. All right, pal. You look changed. Have you been to Whispering Hills? Yeah. Yes, I have, but no sign of your daughter or my son. Oh, no. But I know how you can find them. Oh, how's that? Tell me. Please tell me. By supporting the developers of this mod. <laughs> they put a lot of time into this mod, and with your support, they can make this reunion happen. Oh, right. Sounds good. Sure, I'll do that. Make sure you visit their Discord server and Patreon account. Okay. All right, well, let's just head down to Sanctuary Hills. It's still removing things from my inventory. It's amazing. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<clears throat> We're home, everybody. Annie M. Annie M. We're home. <laughs> Let's just get rid of a few things here, shall we? All right. Yes. Um, I might still be using that. I don't need the fat man. We're gonna put the um, some of this stuff away, maybe. The short combat rifles, those go away. The 44 caliber pistol goes away. Um, anything I don't want to wear. That militia hat, nope, not anymore. The bowler hat is what we're going to keep. That's right. Uh, brain fungus, buff out, goes away. Now, the thing is why I'm here is because once you leave... Uh, Whispering Hills um, and come out into the Commonwealth oh did you think you weren't followed did you really think you ah uh, did you think you weren't followed well let me say this about that I'm just gonna drop off all that junk you may very well have been followed Let's see if we can get the spawn to happen. We'll do a little bit of a rest here. <clears throat> and see if we can't get... Nope, doesn't look like he's gonna show up. Which is a bummer. Just did this not too long ago and... Well... We fell under attack. Let me go sit down and wait a little bit just to show you guys whether or not we can yeah. uh, get this to happen. Okay. Yeah, I know it's getting a little bit long, but uh, let's just see what happens if I wait a couple hours. Nope, not gonna happen. Some days are harder than others. But even the hard days get easier than the one before. Right. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. What can happen? And I'll, I'll have to just explain it because I can't make it happen. Yeah, um... Pyramid Head follows you out. And will appear at randomly in locations as you travel the Commonwealth. Now... When I just did this not a few minutes ago, the problem is I'm recording now, and I wasn't recording then. And so, Pyramid Head isn't going to show up. In that one, he did. My guns shot him, I shot him, we killed him. He has a great sword you can use that does massive damage, medium speed. Perfect. Perfect weapon for your melee build. But that's all the time I have for this. I'm sorry he didn't show. Um, but that's okay. He'll show up for you guys when you play through it. That's the end of the Whispering Hills mod. That is it for our girl, Margaret. We didn't find our son. And I'm not sure if I want to continue playing Fallout 4 all the way through in the traditional sense using this. Um, let me know in the comments if you're interested in watching some more Fallout 4, especially through the horror mod, and we play the entire playthrough at this point from this point forward. Let me know. At any rate, I've been the Bonsai Butterfly. You guys are wonderful, and thanks for hanging in there and watching and supporting me as I go through Fallout. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, what's going on? Huh? Huh? Yeah. It looks like other world is here. Forget what I was saying, guys. Let's just see what happens with this. Shall we? Yeah. It's going to be a little bit of a longer episode, I think, because of that. Nope. Uh, the music's back. Other world has been stunted. I think. Yep. Anyway, guys, I'm going to sign off. 
Bonsai Butterfly out, Whispering Hills done. Like I said, leave a comment if you're interested in seeing any more of our wonderful Margaret as she travels the Commonwealth to find her boy eventually. <laughs> I'm waiting just to see if anything's gonna happen. And it's not, it's not, it's just not. All right, guys. Cheers, friends.